Hi there and welcome back to Life Behind the Levers. These next couple of weeks I'll be floating about on a few different sites as the machine I normally operate is in for service and repair. So in this video I thought I'd put together a week in the life of a plant operator just to show the range of jobs involved in a typical week of an operator's life. I'll be operating a number of different size machineries throughout the coming week. We're on the way to the first job which is emergency road repair. This will involve digging out the existing sub base, restoning with a CBR test and finally tarmacking. We're keeping it old school today with profiles for the levels. The machine is a higher 20 ton 360 which will have a good check over before we start, checking any faults, damage or leaks. We're against the clock on this one so looking forward to getting behind the levers and let's make it a good one.
Today we're off to sunny Carlisle to cover an operator who's away on holiday. I'll be operating a hired Cabota 5-ton 316 which will be mainly lifting peri shutters for a subcontractor. With it being a new site I had to complete my online induction the night before. I find this really helped speed up the process of getting straight onto site the next day. With all the paperwork complete I'm ready to carry out all my pre-start checks and give the windows a quick wipe over. I always enjoy lifting with the excavators as positioning and precision are key factors for a good lift. Quick turnaround with the service and repairs sees me back in the JCB Hydrodig for today's job. We are once again on road repairs which will see us excavating and replacing a soft strip of sub base that runs closest to the verge edge. With the site being so narrow, the transition to a small wheeled excavator is perfect for keeping enough room for site traffic to pass us by. Today's job is as simple as it gets really, but as with every job, a simple one has the potential to quickly turn into a difficult one if approached with the wrong attitude. With bad weather forecast later in the day, we have to stay efficient throughout the shift, leaving today's job ready for the tarmac division ASAP. So with everything checked and prepped, we're ready to go on our wagons.
Another day behind the levers. Today I'll be operating a higher 20 ton 360 and the day will consist of excavating for a deep drainage connection of a new line that will feed into an existing main line. There's live services in close proximity to our excavation so position of the manhole is going to be key. We need to excavate down to set up the base and channels as well as breaking into the existing main line. All the checks complete, let's get into it. On the road again this morning, today we're heading back to a site we've been waiting to finish. Bad traffic this morning was caused by a minor accident. Accidents do happen from time to time and this really stuck in my head while I waited in traffic. Knowing that I need to stay as focused as possible at work today, 
would minimise any mistakes made by me or the team. Getting home safely to loved ones is the most important goal of the day. PP now attached, the hydrogen checked and greased, now we're ready for the shift to start. The job involves the final service connections to the new building. Every new service from the building comes out from this point. So of course the old ones are ready and waiting in the ground to be exposed and connected. Extra care will need to be taken. We will dig some services to the building's new substation. The rest will be exposed and ready for the appropriate provider to connect up. A busy day ahead, so let's get to it. There you have it, a week in the life of UK plant operator. I hope you've enjoyed this week with me. Not only can every week be different, but every day can be too. Being versatile on different machinery every now and again is great, and I really enjoy the challenges that new sites bring. If you're thinking about becoming a plant operator, I hope this video has given you a slight insight to some of the day-to-day -day jobs we as operators go through daily.
Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. It's much appreciated. Stay safe, and I'll see you behind the levers soon.